Normal delivery is painful, but we can make you comfortable during labor. Hello, I am Dr. Anuradha Panda, uh, Senior Consultant Gynecologist at Apollo Hospital, Jubilee Hills. Uh, with experience in laparoscopy and robotic surgery, I have been working here for the last 20 years. Today, we will discuss about epidural nerve blocks. Uh, this is something which we give to reduce your pain during labor. This is effective and a very popular method. Uh, what is done is we uh, inject uh, medications, uh, look anesthetic with some opioid into the epidural space. And then the lower part of the body has less sensation. This injection is usually given in the lumbar area. And then you perceive the pain less. Sometimes you may have no pain, you can just feel the contractions. When do we give it? It's given once you are in active labor, around 4 cm, 3 to 4 cm. We give the injection, a needle is passed, through. it is given by the anesthetist, a needle is passed through the space, then a, a epidural catheter is inserted into the space and then it's connected to a infusion pump. Once started, it continues. Once you are fully dilated, we stop the epidural so that you get the sensation of pain and you can push. There are many advantages of your taking the epidural. You are relaxed, you are alert, but you are pain free. You can't say pain free, but uh, you are very comfortable. And then um, some and most of the time the labor progresses very fast because you are relaxed, the dilatation gets faster. And uh, there are some disadvantages as well. Sometimes you may find that only one part of the body may have feel the pain is less, other part may not but sometimes you may get a little pain but anesthesis will help you overcome that uh, bp sometimes falls and that's very rare and that way it may uh, have a little bit of effect on the baby's heart rate uh, in some conditions uh, you may have little difficulty in urinating sometimes and you can't walk around without uh, support there are some conditions where we do not give you epidural like if you have some infection in the back or there is your platelet counts are low or you are on blood thinning agent and most important I mean what would you say you make uh, progress very fast or you may come late in labor so we do not give you because we think you will deliver very soon uh, after going through the process so I would say most of you would ask uh, how would it affect my baby Usually it has very negligible effect on the baby though we give very low dose of the local anesthetic with that fent or fent with fentanyl. Sometimes there may be little difficulty in uh, feeding in the beginning but more or less the babies are all fine. And uh, it, it would be better that whenever you are in labor or when, whenever you are following up with your gynecologist you should be uh, counseled or should ask your uh, obstetrician about uh, uh, epidural analgesia and even the anesthetist will explain it to you once you are admitted so that you can be mentally prepared. There's people sometimes say I don't go, want to go through normal labor because it's painful but apart from giving you some medications, injections, we have this method of epidural analgesia where we give you pain relief and you are comfortable during labor and it's a good method and you should always opt for it. Thank you.